What the? Wait, um, what was that slap? Wait, why is she doing that? Wait, did she really believe what Sid said? Oh my god. Gotcha. Oh, what the hell? Whoa. Wait, is he gonna eat her? Is he gonna bite her? What? We could just blast through all of them at once, right? Wait, what does he mean by that? Wait, is he gonna use atomic? Bro, even she's surprised by how much power he has, bro. Atomic. Oh, atomic. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. So, I'm pretty sure everyone died in there. <laughs>
Wait, don't tell me. Ow! Oh, that's why they got out of there. Maybe that's the reason why. Jesus Christ, dude. I was not expecting another atomic. I swear to God. Jeez, just look at that. Just, mm, oh, magnificent. So, I'm pretty sure everyone died in there. <laughs> hmm. Wait, okay. So, Sid is in a dark place. Wait, what's there? Oh, the devil ha Is it the devil's hand? Yo, that was weird. What was that? Oh, wait, what the heck? Wait, are they in like an uh, imaginary world again? Oh, okay, wait, they're back at the forest place. Oh, he was able to pull his heart. Oh, okay, you know, I should have saw that coming. Bro, I mean, I swear to God. Oh, no. Oh, no, not to her, not her, bro. Why? Wait, so she was the one that called him over here. It wasn't just the book or the door. Oh, damn. This is sad, bro. I liked her. I mean, even though she's crazy, in a way, in a sense, she seemed interesting, though. I mean, he was able to, like, you know, meet someone that had almost the exquisite power as well. So, in a way, they were able to become, like, very, like, friends in a way, you know? Oh, wait. Never mind. She kissed him. <laughs> yeah. Wait, if she's ever to find a real me. Wait, so... He's alive? Yeah. That was... That was something. Wait. Don't tell me you forgot what she said. Oh, no. Hey, it's the three waifus that, you know, we will never see them get together with Sid. <laughs> Doesn't it just kill you? Wait. Kill you? For what? Holy crap. Wait, Sid. Oh, my God. He actually did a lot to the city place. Jesus, it drowned the whole place. Hmm, you know what? This is kind of interesting that Alexia and Rose maybe actually try to do something, you know, rather important to the story. But then again, who knows what they'll do, you know? But this is kind of interesting that how the organization of the Shadow Garden is able to motivate these, like, powerhouses to maybe do something. Damn, bro. <laughs> I mean, Alexia, I, she's smart and elegant, but, I mean, come on, give her some time to, like, think about it. Hey, okay, looks like Alexia and Rose are gonna be working together. Not bad. Wait, Beta do? Well, okay, of course, someone has to be, like, be with them in the inside, you know? Oh, okay. Wait, is it Alpha and a chick with no tits, right? <laughs> so Alpha already thought he planted this out. <laughs> Wait, it appears our theory is correct. The Witch of Calamity, another name, the Demon Diablo. Wait, so she is a Demon Diablos? What? He knows everything. Uh, I don't think our boy Sid knows everything at most. Whoa, wait, wait, wait. Let me see that again. Uh, okay, they're just like showing both the times where our boy Sid like absolutely destroyed a place when he used this atomic bomb power, which is absolutely insane. Hey, I gotta say, I mean, she be making money. Hey, to make money, you gotta spend money, am I right? Bro, man, even among the waifus of our boy Sid has waifus among them, bro. What the fuck? What the fuck is that? I mean, it looks like they be working hard, bro. They need a rest, you know? <laughs> Oh, that's hilarious. <laughs> you know, it seems nice that Alpha, since before till now, a lot of things has changed. What the fuck? Wait, he was able to make a modern Japanese house in this world. What the hell? Oh, Bro, I mean, I feel like to Sid, these girls are like his daughters in a way, you know? Now that I think about it. It's kind of funny how, like, they're still so young, but yet they have this tremendous amount of power to do. Damn, bro, I gotta read a light novel, I swear to God. Irv, I swear. Hey. <laughs> hey, you know what? A place where you could, like, sweat and relax and enjoy yourself while just talking about business, you know? Wow, so even the managed see or the father himself said, like, don't make a move. Wow. 
The Bushin Festival. Ooh, okay. Seems like we're gonna get another tournament. Another tournament that maybe our boy Sid may enter. Maybe. And I wouldn't be surprised if they're at the festival as well. For sure, will not be defeated. I don't know, I mean, since we saw that atomic power, it's hard to judge. Oh, well, I mean, our boy said just did. <laughs> it's funny how they were able to switch conversations just like that. Damn, man, so she's really hoping. I mean, she has everything on this tournament that she has to win. What the? Wait, um, what was that slap? Wait, why is she doing that? Wait, did she really believe what Sid said? Oh my god. And see, wait, is she really thinking about... Oh, right, she did see him. Well, technically he had a paper in his head. I mean, paper bag on his head. Wait, what the fuck was that? Whoa, what the heck? What is that? Wait, why does she have that? I'm so confused. No, wait, is this a... This is a cliffhanger! Ah, oh, fuck! <laughs> Time to review today's episode. So, I gotta say, today's episode has been somewhat crazy, funky, and absolutely insane. At the very beginning, we get to see the conclusion of just how insane our boy Sid is. With just the kind of way he thinks on, like, just his fighting tactics you know seeing how he's able to like move his organs and his body so then when he gets pierced he's able to like not take that much damage but he'll still bleed but not as effective and just seeing him like turn oh bro and just by seeing sid twist olivia's wrists and then turn her around and then bind her in the neck and then ripping her neck apart and then seeing all that blood come out i was not expecting that i was expecting at least him like tearing her neck or twisting her neck but seeing him like taking a bite out of her i was like yo what the heck but then after seeing that the old man was still able to like summon a bunch of olivia's i guess our boy sid had to pull out his ultimate card and it's none other than the atomic bomb himself i was actually really surprised to get to see that once again i thought it was like a one-time use but goddamn, is he able to still use that atomic bomb in this situation still but seeing our booba crazy lady finally disappear and saying like when you find me please it looks like our boy said didn't really get the message which really sucks because i was really hoping that he would you know maybe try to find her but i guess maybe it won't be happening but then again who knows with that said it actually seemed like that lady the crazy one the calamity lady is actually the devil the devil person i believe because from the information that alpha has gotten that is the same person as the person that is like chained up with the arms and then seeing alexia rose and beta like actually forming up into a group to like help or to finally investigate like what's really going on i was actually pretty surprised by that i was not expecting them to try to like form a group i mean of course they have like some pretty strong powerful families in that situation so i think they could do a lot of things but of course the only reason that beta join is because she wants to be in the inside to know what's happening with alexia and rose and also to guide them as well just like always the shadow organization is always in the shadow and always like manipulating on what's really happening around a lot of situations and also trying to find a cult of course and then at the very end we get to see rose just like training and then her gain like a chest pain it seemed like but seeing like there's like red veins popping out from her chest like it seemed very weird i don't know how much i can take from these cliffhangers i swear to god man now one more cliffhanger and i'm out of here bro i'm i swear to god i'm out with that said if you guys happen to enjoy my reaction on today's episode hit that like button if you guys want to see more action on the 15th episode hit that subscribe button if you guys haven't already but that's pretty much all i gotta talk about it's been your boy for senpai and i'll see you guys in the next episode